All right, Delta something is this ship. Let's see if this one loads correctly. Let's see if I can tell. Ah, I see one. Okay, here we go. The Delta 9. Custom image, easy to see. It looks like this loaded correctly. I think this loaded correctly. All right. 20th time was the charm. Let's see what Delta 9 can do. And I might try to speed run this. Uh, Eagle Corps decided to go all in on this gunship. Its weapons are powerful. It has stronger hull. Yet they just couldn't find the time to boost this monster with adequate engines. All right. We got shields with a value point. We have an, a heavy flak. What does that mean? Treading power up time for faster traveling flak and more damage. So it's slower charge, but holy crap, each flak does two damage. Okay, and pierces a shield. Holy crap. And a big freaking laser. It's big as bad and hits really hard. Point away from self, let it warm up. Soon enemy ships cease to exist. Three power, 18 second charge time. It chains for faster charge and does four damage. I might be able to speedrun this ship, uh, especially once we get five weapon power. All right, I wanted to play this as no pause, so I'm going to attempt to not pause. We have Gibbs for the rebellion! Cool ship design. Did you do the uh, ship image? We have the uh, invisible Gibbs, the best type of Gibbs. Free scrap. Cool. Um, we just have a casual crystal crew, that's right. Casual. Put them on weapons. In there, NG on there, I guess, something like this. I think we can probably speed run this one. Um, I don't have enough power, but I have a backup battery, strangely. Interesting. <coughs> well, let's take that bonus scrap and get power. I don't know what you're linking, TurboJet, but I'm not going to click on it because I, I got to play this game. You feel like you've seen this? Whole image, it looks familiar as well. You found it on the internet, you did some basic editing. Okay. Well, if anybody... I always say this because I want to give credit to the, the artists. If anybody knows who designed this, the original piece that was edited by Eagle's Eye, let me know, and I'll put in the YouTube description credit to whoever that designer is. I will say it looks like the heavy flak uh, is slightly less accurate, so that's another downside it looks like to this crazy OP-looking flak we have here. Pay attention to the shields, weapons, the backup battery systems. Okay, well, shields does have a value point. Um, I'm not sure if I see what I should be seeing. You want to have the non-Grima human. Sure. Did we already get a Grima request? Yes, we did. Okay. Alright, Grima... And a turbo jet. Okay. The upgrades. Oh, oh, like maybe the upgrade costs or something? Okay, I haven't seen that yet. Free shield hack with a burst laser two, heavy laser one. These are the ships that... I think basically breaks... Uh, not having reset as an option for goddamn <sighs> bullshit in FTL, man. Jesus Christ, this is a freaking shriek ender ship. Hope I don't get a ship like this tomorrow. Christ almighty. We have more starting health, at least. Freaking hell. F you, FTL, this bullshit ship. It's gonna be the crystal. Alright, well, give me a bit. I'm trying to not die right now. I did not die to bullshit. There, okay, now we can't do any more damage. The upgrades to the systems you mentioned, which are shields, weapons, a backup battery, are custom, okay? Custom upgrades. Okay, let's heal these dudes. Somebody wanted to be the crystal, who was it? It was... Relazumo. Okay. Relazumo. Bellim, be, bellissimo. Be, relazumo? I, I don't know. Sounds Italian. Uh, please don't die, sir, though. Uh, 
Um, right after this fight, you have a request. I know. Thank you. Um, so what am I paying attention to with the weapon upgrades? Oh, they're cheaper at higher levels. I think that's cheaper. Shields are definitely cheaper. Okay, and backup battery is level 3 and cheaper. Okay. WTF are the engines? Oh, <laughs> I guess that's the trade-off. Low engines, but cheaper uh, weapon and shield uh, upgrades. Okay, okay. Interesting. How much for the second shield? 30, so we're almost there. I kind of want the weapon first, but... I need a lot of power to use any of those things, so... That is nine weapon power as well. Okay. All the skinny room ships for my flak. We can get five shields and nine weapon power. Cool. Fuck this fucking fucker game. Agreed. <laughs> Agreed, Fast Rand. <laughs> Uh. Switch to the BFL as it was intended for? Does this pierce shields? Oh, it does pierce all shields. Okay. So it was intended to start with this. Okay. <laughs> the ship could be the triple charge two build. Oh man. I don't know, man. It's slow and one shot. A single dodge. This guy gets out. Uh, I don't know if this is better. I guess it gets faster charging. You're supposed to switch between the weapons depending on the ship. Okay, so I guess for skinny rooms, you want me to use this big effing laser. Gotcha. I assume that's what you mean. Uh, half power. We don't really do half power well. I can't do manly search. Shields, I guess. This ship can be flackening 3.0, too. This ship could be so many things, chat. So many things. Okay, skinny rooms. We swap over. him dodge my first laser and I will wish I'd kept my flak on. Okay, he did not. Thank goodness. Missiles are going to be a pain. Yeah, well, we need cloaking. We gave Rand a ship with a special flak and expect him to use a different weapon sometimes. <laughs> yes. Do you know who I am? Have you been to the stream before? Have you heard of Heavy Flack? What do you expect of me? This cooldown is 18 to 12 to 6. Seems pretty good. True. Leave him. Don't want to risk our crew. How are we ever going to spin up if it two shots every ship? Another good point. Right, I need power, and dodge is even more expensive, too, so... You can't get a 100% chance to dodge on this ship. Oh. Yeah, you're probably right, aren't you? Yeah. If, uh... Engines Max is at level 2 or whatever. Uh, I can lock you out of here. Or level 3, I guess it is. And even with cloaking, we get max of probably, what, like 80 or 90%, something like that. 85, okay. Okay, I'm seeing 85, 95, and 90. <laughs> Even chat doesn't know how much this could get. Um, 15 plus 10%. From full training should be 25%, plus 60 from da from cloaking should be 85. I'm pretty sure it's 85 is the max. I'll throw my, my number into the mix. <laughs> now it's just 
Chat is just numbers, great. You are fake news. Well, so is Eagle's Eye, the person who designed the ship, so don't feel bad. Oh wait, no. I'm wrong, it is 95% because I didn't take into consideration the dodge from piloting. I was only taking the engines. So if you don't consider it and piloting, I think it's 85. If you do consider piloting, I think it's 95. Yeah, I think it should be 95, actually. But I'm also wrong. Listen to the ship creator, dang it. Well, I don't know why I claim to be right. I freaking did math on stream and got it wrong. If I got it right, I'd be surprised. I honestly feel like I have played this ship design coloration before. It looks very familiar to me. I think somebody else has used this ship. Uh... Fucking fuck you. <laughs> this uh, uh, whole image before, I think. There's a bug on your screen. No way, that's just a new Lania ship. Yep, yep. Okay, well, we two shot him. It's good. Holy free 15 hull repair from that earlier free shield hack. That's very nice. Why Grima not on piloting? Because I don't want him to be. I don't know. I didn't crew kill. Uh oh. Ruin the run. Um, let me see. I'm gonna get engines, then power, and then I'm gonna upgrade weapons. But I do not like. Well, okay, maybe I don't do. Mm, yeah, I'll do the power because the weapon's gonna take the power. It does look rather lanius ish. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like rock. It's like rock. Um, Frankenstein into lanius. Skinified with whatever that fuck piece is. That's my description of it. Grima's is not on piloting because it's too far from the airlock, obviously. What? He gives me free scrap for some reason. I guess the entrance civilian sector always does this. Uh, <laughs> cool. Not sure if it's supposed to, but cool. Alright, you know what? I said I was going to get power. I just want to get this weapon up upgraded. Why are you on piloting turbojet? You don't even know how to fly a ship. Okay. They're just pirates. Well then, why did you volunteer to be on my ship? Everybody knows how to do everything on my ship. No lazy people allowed. Two missiles off for my missile, uh, for my laser. Death sadly. by a thousand fucking missiles. All these skinny room ships over here. Multiple sectors have special things. Mind control also helps. Oh, with that blue option, having mind control gives you something? Interesting. Grima only knows how to fly without a ship when he's out the airlock. That's true. That is the opposite of fake news. That is true news. Or, I don't know, whatever the opposite of fake news is. What of your medical condition? Uh, you signed a waiver. We'll clone you if you need to. You signed a waiver when you uh, got on this ship. We do not accept existing, pre-existing medical conditions as an excuse from doing work or being vented or being fed to a mantis. It was in the fine print. If you didn't read it, it's really your own fault. Sorry. Sorry about that. It's in the fine, fine print. What if you have a seizure while piloting? Well, then it'll be a wild ride. <laughs> you know what? Manly search. Nice. 
Uh, there is a breach somewhere. If you have a seizure, then everybody's gonna be like, yeah! Woo! It's like going on a roller coaster. It'll be like, uh, we took a trip to Disneyland real quick. We go on Turbo Jet's ro wild ride. I mean, they just think, well, his name's Turbo Jet. He's probably laying on the turbo and flying real fast. Because he was bored otherwise. It's like Maverick. He's gonna... What is it called? And uh, they doesn't top gun, trim the tower, or whatever he does. Alright, free borders. Uh, where are they? They're in my doors. Okay. Buzz the tower? Is it buzz the tower? Yeah, buzz the tower. That's the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the ticket. Uh, this is not venting very fast. There we go, lock him out. It's big frickin' laser is the uh, PG-13 version. semi eighth. Top Gun was a good movie. Glad you enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, it was a good movie. I have not seen the new one, though. I think the computer knows what to do with your voice commands. Okay. Lord Randington isn't responsible for hazardous labor conditions. Any protest will be met with violence and venting. Mainly venting, though. Mainly venting. True, at least they brought snacks. Quite true. Uh, a cheap NG is a good deal. Wow, that's really cheap. I'm gonna probably regret that eventually, but silly device. We never regret getting a silly device. Gee, Cremity, welcome aboard, silly device. Jiminy Christmas, welcome aboard. So many skinny room ships, man. It's like they knew I have a heavy flak that they don't want me to be able to hit with. I can freely give you orders to smack people around or blast them. Um, okay. Uh, this is a four damage hole laser, okay. Or heavy laser. I stole their four, their two power, two damage Artemis. I did? How did I do that? I didn't notice me doing that. Well, that sucks. these three effing projectiles in sector one and I just dodged zero effing projectiles with cloaking is this sector one no this is sector two isn't it yeah sector two still still fuck me man every goddamn shot has hit my weapons as well f your weapons too douchebag jesus christ three shots in a row to weapons that's some bullshit it's a passive of the ship to get no dodges. Great. Well, I hope I can fix that. This is basically a four damage heavy pierce. That speeds up and costs one extra power or something, I guess. Actually, I should have done this a different way. This pierces all shields, doesn't it? Yes, okay. I need to fire the big, big effing laser at shields and then shoot my flak. This is like some weird bizarro world where I s shoot the heavy laser before the flak, I guess. The bizarro build. Even though I see a store, I'm going to do that. Upgrade. Skip the store, honestly, unless I have something to sell.
Dodging these shots would be a whole of a lot easier if I had better engines. Okay. No fucking counterplay to that shit. <laughs> I know, right? Fast ran, no counterplay. You can't dodge stupid. Max the engines already. Well, we're almost there. Okay, double reward is nice. Um, I do have a shield charge booster to sell. Hacking will be 80. Engine upgrades 40. Um, I think I skip the store. I'd have to sell two things to get hacking, maybe? Or does shield charge booster sell for enough? 22. It does not sell for enough. I'd have to sell my long-range scanners, and I just don't want to do that. Waiting for free engine upgrade event. That would actually be very nice. Okay, outpost. If I'd gotten this before the fight, that would have been nice. Actually, I guess I do it this way. Because of the size of the rooms. And at least you gave the ship, what, 40 max health instead of 30? To make up for the fact that we'll never dodge anything ever, it feels like. No, there were two stores, but uh, they were both down where I'd have to dive. Well, one I could have gotten without diving, but it would have been not enough scrap to get hacking, which is kind of my only goal right now. Oh, we started out with 45 health. Okay. So you gave it no dodges. Weapons that are very strong, but slow. So... This ship is going to be tanking a lot of damage. There's no way to stop it. I'm going to have to spend a bunch of scrap on repairs. Just no... No counterplay to that, shiznizzle. As past Rand would say. What's up, Nietzsche? The lore is anytime you get stunned, you're actually having a small seizure in the piloting room. Okay, great. Uh, have fun with that. Uh, enjoy your seizures. Just kidding. Seizures, seizures are no joke. Like giant alien spiders. Oh god, he's running. Okay, heal. Not much going on. You just woke up at 8.30 p.m. Are you on the... Let me guess. Are you on the shift where you work overnight or mornings or something? You get those weird shift changes, right? You have to change your sleep schedule, sleeping schedule every time. All right. Rock boarding, huh? <laughs> You do, but not this time. Let's just say you had a late night last night. Uh, what game were you binging? That's the question. What game? Uh, did you say you were into one of the Final Fantasies right now, maybe? Like it was one of the MMO Final Fantasies. Oh. Ho oh, ho. Oh. Wow. We can get more of these? Did you just replace the normal flak with the heavy flak? Because that is... Wow, okay. Okay. I'm getting double heavy flaks here. Even if they're inaccurate, that's going to be ridiculous. Uh, you're into F Final Fantasy XI, playing a bit of Rebirth 2 at the moment. Okay, okay. NG, please. When adding a weapon, you can pick it. 
you can pick if it'll show up in stores. Okay. Okay. Strip the nearby asteroid for scrap. Cool. Looking for hacking still. I'm gonna add, uh, let's see. Heavy garbage dispensation commence. That's the plan. I forgot to move my crew back to where they're supposed to be. Silly device. Go back to your doors. Wow. Alright, double heavy flak. Let's not miss the room I'm shooting for every time, please. Okay. Alright, we hit it that time. What a good flak and deal. So I don't know how... I don't remember how a Final Fantasy XI mechanics go, but what what kind of character are you maining in Final Fantasy XI? Like, do they have roles where it's tank, DPS, heals, or is it some other thing in Final Fantasy XI? I know there's something about jobs, you can train different jobs, but don't you have to choose to be a certain role when doing groups or something? Smog gives you free scrap every time you enter a new sector. Maybe it's only when you're at green sectors, I don't know. Here's the hacking. Didn't even check the other thing, but okay with that. Okay. 19 drone parts. Let's get how much do the repairs are cheap right now. Get them while they're cheap. Get them while they're cheap. Final Fantasy XI was your first MMO. Oh, the nostalgia. Civilian and NG give you free stuff. Can't remember if you get special stuff at others, though. Okay. Do, do, do. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I think that works. You're the only one who didn't get injured that encounter. Well done. Well done. This is a safe fight, so I could train. But I don't really care about training. No need. I'll get whatever training I can get from the fight. Uh, tanks back in Final Fantasy XI were either Paladin or Ninja, depending on what you were fighting, but it could have changed. Okay. Well, when we played WoW, Nietzsche was... What did Nietzsche you start out as? You started out as a Warlock, and then you swapped to Paladin to tank, I think. Uh, you main Samurai, which is direct damage, comma, tank. Corsair, which is a buffer and direct damage. Bard, which is a buffer and direct damage. And White Mage heals. A lot of different versions of damage and buffing, mostly, it looks like, huh? Interesting. Can you swap between any of those at any time? You have four accounts. <laughs> At the same time, you're four boxing. Ah, oh, no wonder. I had a friend in college who started three or four boxing EverQuest, and uh, that's. Uh, I, I understand. I understand the the addiction. I understand it's. My college roommate did something very similar. Just an EverQuest. That's funny. Uh, okay. Nice. No more weapons for you. I didn't do my uh, depower the shields trick like I should have. Yeah. You two box Final Fantasy XI. You could really use the on-the-job experience. Okay, you're talking about being a pilot. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm trying to remember. Uh, my college roommate. I was playing a bard. That's back when I played EverQuest and actually got my bard epic. And he, I think, three boxed a warrior. An enchanter and a cleric, I think. It's called cleric and it was called cleric and in EverQuest. 
So he'd be three box and I'd be buffing the group. And I was like, well, that's way, much, way more work to be three boxing over there. But uh, I'm just twisting all my songs over here on my bard. Wow, you must be really into it if you are uh, <laughs> four boxing Final Fantasy XI. Alright, this guy cannot damage us. This single border I can vent. How much stuff can you do in Final Fantasy Solo? Can you do raid content or is it like dungeons? What all can you do? Probably depends how good you are, I'm sure, but like if you're good, can you do all end game content? I don't know like what size raiding groups there are in Uh oh, nice quadruple reward, baby. I don't know what kind of raid size groups there are in Final Fantasy XI. When you played Final Fantasy XI, almost nothing was soloable. Your boss talks. Your boss talks about two boxing everquests as, everquests as well, yeah. Okay, um. One power, then I'd probably save up towards the weapon upgrade next. Or poking our mind control, we'll see. You couldn't even level solo effectively? Well, that's how uh, EverQuest was. I wouldn't be surprised if, uh... Final Fantasy decided to go that route back then. Final Fantasy XI was holy one-shot. Was, uh... That was... That was after WoW, right? But it was before, like, Guild Wars 2... Some, somewhere in the in-between era. Name the new Zolt. I guess that's NG Jasmine, huh? Okay, one second. Steps in the debris. It was a pain, but in hindsight, you liked it because it forced you to learn how groups work and interact with people. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. I agree that the reason MMOs have died is because all of the convenient stuff to make solo leveling better and finding groups faster means you don't actually ever get forced to group that much and when you group there's no... Wow, we're getting so much free stuff. There's no... Like, I don't know, it doesn't feel like you, you need to. You can just kind of go through soloing and then get pick up raids or something for like modern day WoW or something. How much cloaking I can't afford, sadly. Maybe I can come back and afford it. Um, looks like a big, fat, empty, empty net NG sector, so maybe not. Uh, Final Fantasy XI was actually six months before WoW. Oh, okay. Man, I wonder if I ever played it then. I feel like I tried it at some point. Okay. So this is the NG quest, alright. With your group, you can do almost everything solo, possibly not optimally. For example, an end game. Uh oh god, it's wait. I was gonna say this is uh whatchamacallit? Um Zoltan Border Police, but these aren't Zoltans. Uh, for example, in endgame instance sortie, you could get 5,000 points of run solo, but with six actual people, you could get 30,000. Okay. Well, we did one shot of Zoltan Shield with this six heavy lasers we have here. If I got that reward before, right uh, by the store, I would have gotten that. Poking online, oh well. Started playing Final Fantasy XI. Hey, I started playing it, saying I just played it till WoW came out, and then once WoW came out, you never actually switched to WoW, huh? huh? There's some stuff you can't do yourself still. You still have a, still you have a friend that also four boxes and you duo stuff. Ha ha ha. Well, so you have eight people that you 
Eight different characters being played by two different players. That's pretty crazy. As intended, I'm sure. The poor solo abilities while you never got into Eleven much. Yeah, I wonder if, as much as I talk about liking them forcing grouping, I wonder if I'd enjoy it trying to get into a game that that's is, is, is that old. Because I've tried to get back into different versions of EQ many times. And it often is just so grindy that I can't stick with it. Okay, so this was the correct one. So the other one is a ship fight we can just kill. So... Uh, what's up, the house? Just for a quick stop here, how are the hands? They're actually pretty tired, and I don't think it's from last Friday. I think it was last night I was playing too much. Uh, what was I playing last night? I was playing... Uh, Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, and... Something else. Um, fairy Tale Fables. I just played too many games. I think they change it to make it a lot easier these days for Final Fantasy XI. That is literally all my fuel, sir. Did I go to a store and not buy fuel or something? I feel like I'm lower in fuel than I should be. Nearly PM to be Rock and Stone, yes. I was playing... I was playing a lot yesterday. I was really bored. I was... My brother and my friend Tim in our message group on Facebook Messenger were talking about this game they've been really enjoying that I talked about earlier, uh, a Unicorn Overlord or whatever, and I was like, I want to play an awesome game too, and there's just nothing I'm dying to play right now until another, I don't know, a really good MMO or something comes out. Kill him. Or uh, Path of Exile 2 is probably the next thing that I know is coming out this year that I'm really excited to be like another fun off stream game to play. FTLs are always there when you need it most to troll me. Yeah, there's a store at least. Damn, can I get this quest and not run out of fuel? I hope so. It'll help you sell your missiles on Rock A, get rid of your last three units of fuel. It helps so much. How do you land hacking when there's a defense drone? Um, damn it, I need to make a YouTube short on that. You depower your drone at the right time. TLDR, depower your drone at the right time. And then physics happens gets by. Uh, if you Google um, defense drone hacking bypass trick FTL, you'll, there's probably many good uh, YouTube videos about it. I just haven't made a YouTube short of it. I need to. Chat, next time we get a defense drone, remind me. I need to make a YouTube short. We can do that right now. And make it the next time we get one to show how it works. Two, three, four. Can't get all my jumps because of this layout. Uh, I will buy all of the fuel. Thank you. And we can do it on the boss if we don't get one before. True, true. And since I'm not playing specifically no pause, I can pause and describe what's happening and that kind of thing too. Good frickin' doge, man. Alright, rather dodge the missile than the bomb. Ooh, I'm late on this. His lasers go off, don't they? Damn. Okay, pain. Pain. Pain and dodges for him means... Well, we did get that free heal, so it's fine. Okay, Grima and Slay Device go heal.
So yes, if you remember, Gary, remind me. On the days to the boss, create a YouTube short for defense drone bypass trick for hacking. One of the most important tools I feel like if you want to be consistently winning on hard mode is get the most out of your oh my gosh uh, hacking abilities. Oh my god, are we gonna get the heavy flackening? Wait, cloaking was cheaper. These things cost a lot, right? Yeah, 120. All right, well, I can't... Oh, I can get 9 weapon power, too. Oh, my gosh. Um, I feel like I need to sell that anyway, because I don't think I ever get enough scrap for... Well, maybe I do. It's going to be really expensive, because we have all the systems now. But all I need are upgrades, and we're only in Sector 4, so maybe we can make it happen. Yeah, you made cloaking cheaper. Okay. All right. Attack, working attack, Peace will end you wait. All right, well, we have our systems done, so now it's just uh, get as much scrap to get as many upgrades as possible. Oh, cool cloaking image. Wow, that's really cool. I like the blue glow in that cloaking image. Really good job on that. I like it. He told me flackening 3.0. Well, if we find another heavy flak, we're selling this big frickin' laser. That's for sure. <clears throat> that took you a while for that cloaking image? It looks really good. I like it. I like it. We're gonna just live in NG sectors. We have all greens, ha! <laughs> all greens means all free stuff on the first jump of each sector. Uh, not one to miss an opportunity to take advantage. Use your basic mind control to alter the NG's predisposition to your advantage. 43 free scrap for having mind control. Ooh, okay. Alright, well there's triple heavy flak. No shield upgrades, who needs them? Okay. Uh, he is running. I'm gonna hack his drone control, because I see that ion intruder drone. I see it. And I don't want it. Don't want it. Pilot. Get one shot. Alright, time to one shot every ship the rest of this run. Is what it's looking like here. Uh, I do need power. Triple heavy flak, man. One damage for 45 scrap. I'll take it. I mean, I couldn't afford another heavy flak right now, so I think I'm gonna skip this store. We need to have enough for 125, 120 to buy the fourth heavy flak. I will buy six fuel. We're behind on fuel. No, I don't. I don't have enough. BFL does not sell for however much it needed. I am not getting the free mantis today, I guess. Quadruple defense drones. So hashtag balanced, chat. So hashtag balanced. You can't focus for his volley. Of course, I'm talking about balance with uh, <laughs> this ridiculous heavy flak weapon, so probably shouldn't talk about that. It's fine, it's fine. Hacking drone bypass uh, defense drone YouTube short time. Uh, <laughs> I guess that would have been a good ship for it. Whoops, I forgot. His weapons were too strong. I need a fight that's safer. Or something, I don't know. How much does the uh, laser sell for? 60. Wow, okay, we actually would have enough. Okay, we'll check the store. Alright, engines are maxed, chat. 
FTL deserves this flacking punishment. Yes, it does. Let's go drone schematic. Or more scrap. Oh, one shot the NG on weapons. Get wrecked. Get shrekified. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Seen two stores, so if we're gonna see another one, it would have to be one of these two jumps, I think. Except they're all for free stuff, baby. Holy shnikes, that was a lot of free stuff. Love NG free stuff. Uh, terrible deal. Oh gosh, okay. Hey friends, aren't we in an NG sector? Why do we keep getting boarded by mantids, man? Must be their sacred hunting grounds or whatever the flavor text is or whatever. destroying these dudes. Alright. This is basically the heavy flackening is what this is. It's not the flackening, it is the heavy flackening. Which is way heavier than the normal flackening. Okay. Uh, these weapons are decent. I will cloak if needed. Down. Didn't actually put any cloak there. Might take damage here. Nope. Just funny you play tested and got three BFLs and played with them in a pre igniter. Wow. So three of those weapons that pierce all shields and do four damage. You must have made them the lowest rare, or the the least rare, the um, to be able to find that many, or just got really lucky, because to find three of these heavy flax in four stores or whatever we got seems pretty pretty low rarity. Three or four for both. All right, more free stuff. Oh gosh. Okay, um... Get their shield, because why not? Five is the highest rarity, and you think you did three or four for both, for both. Okay. Well, whatever the rarity is, I'm enjoying heavy flackening my enemies, that's for sure. Uh, somehow I didn't fire this weapon. Okay, nice hole repair. Still no store. I'm gonna keep wondering why I can't upgrade my engines every time I, uh... go into my upgrades, or every time I'm thinking about upgrades, hmm, what can I upgrade? Oh, I need engines. And then realize, oh, I am at max engines already. My heavy flackening punishment is I can't get higher level engines. Okay, kill your friends. I can't get any higher flacking engines, chat. Go, don't go any flacking higher. 
get blasted. Uh, this is sector six, and I do need a lot of scrap. I will take the ship fight, even though there was just a store I could go to. Same fight over and over. My control while two shutting them with our crazy OP weapons. Dot 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 profit. Dot 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 profit. Rarity zero is on a table outside of initial loadout or special events. Okay. So I guess the most common rarity is rarity one then. Is rarity one what flak one is that shows up all the time and first laser ones and stuff? Yeah, but I guess you're right. Rarity zero is technically the rarest since you can't can't get it outside of starting builds. Move hacky, give me the free stuff. I think my uh, cargo bay is almost full, not quite full. Black one, you believe, is rarity two. Okay. All right, explosive replicator, backup DNA bank. No uh, heavy flak here. So, um, I'll buy a clone bay. Why not? Why the hell not? I got scrap to burn. I don't have to run my guys back and forth to heal every time. You also get better free stuff with a higher level mind control. Ah, okay. Spoiler alert. Maybe I'll get the 999 scrap for an elite system upgrade, yes. Do I need to do that on this? mod, though. I don't think I do. I feel like I keep hearing stuff in my building. I think they are, like, painting and slamming doors and stuff. Jeez. Jeez, man. Jeez. Jeez. So, we have seven, six, five, four, four, three, Three, two, one, all right. We are very rich this run, that's quite true. All right, so far no fourth flak. Fourth heavy flak, sadly. Do, 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 do. do some upgrades that we don't need, but I want because we're OP and way far ahead. And ridiculously strong and rich. The rich get richer. <laughs> uh, wow. All these NG sectors just keep giving me free stuff. It's like, okay, you win. Here's all the free stuff. Just take your riches and go kill the boss. Man, maybe I should even go level 3 mind control in case we get some crazy big free stuff. Well, I don't know if it's only NG sectors, and I don't know if my other green sectors are going to be all NG sectors that have been giving us the free stuff for the mind control. Wow, only 27 scrap. So cheap. I mean, what, what the hell? Let's do it. Do you have long range scanners? I do. Okay. Thinking about upgrading sensors, but I'm pretty sure everything that level two sensors can give you, long range scanners can give you. Human gives me mantis. I don't have mantis yet. Let's do it. I'm on board, Agent Smith. Be on sensors. NGB over here somewhere. Rand gets all the free stuff on viewership day. FTL says with a smirk, see you tomorrow. Yes. Yes. Well, hopefully I can outplay whatever shenanigans the smirking FTL will throw at us. Because holy crap, this is kind of ridiculous. This is so much free stuff. So much freaking free stuff. 
Why can't I hold all this free stuff? God. The, the triple heavy flak just one shots whoever is manning the system, too. <laughs> Start to run into power problems. You did make backup battery cheaper in three levels. Yes, yes. Thank you for that reminder. All right. Uh, let's see if level three mind control does anything for this NG sector. Your advanced mind control system just lays there, turned off. How utterly terrible would it be to flip it on? The NG unknowingly piles on the scrap and throws in a free weapon to boot. <laughs> nice. Well. Well, so this was a, basically an all NG run with a bunch of free stuff to go with my free stuff so that if I run out of free stuff, I can get more free stuff. Because, you know, we wouldn't want to run out of free stuff, though. What a ridiculous run this is. These fucking dodges! Uh, let's level three mind control you. And I'll even hack your weapons. For good measure. No missiles allowed. Let them live gets me a free weapon. All right. <laughs> uh, that would have been funny if we killed the guy after we took the free weapon, which shouldn't be possible. What's up, just a guy? Uh, the galaxy supporting the Federation caused this run. Yeah, no kidding. Like, all right, we've we've made you work hard enough in the past, but for once we'll be like, okay. Here's some weapons and stuff to give you a better chance. You realize you are fighting for the rest of the galaxy here. Or at least the non-humans in the galaxy. I think my hold must be full now. <laughs> yes, it is. Right as you say it. All right, so that's for 25, 30. 27, 32, 30. So beam drones the deepest one. This is actually ridiculous. What the hell is going on right now? What is this? Uh... Well, that sells for less than the rest of my stuff. All right, we're just we're just trailing flung out drone parts that we can't fit on our ship now. Except they're off for free stuff. All right. Eagle Corps is taking over. Eagle Corps, is that the name of your company in the game or something? It's looking... <laughs> 600. It's looking less and less like I'm gonna find that other heavy flak, which is the only thing I really want. Scrap order achievement. Great. Uh, did I only get one store? I bet you I had another store down there. Unless I have one over there, maybe. That's the company in your lore that's making all of the ships. Gotcha. Uh, get off rock, damn. All right, well, free stuff, though. I'm not even spending it. I mean, what? I, True, I'm not. What do I even need? I want to get 999 scrap to show that we can. Uh, no. The cup overflow with the three stuff, it really is, it's just never ending. Okay. It really is. Because I could get this other weapon online. I could get that and like everything else I want, but I don't need it. We're murdering everybody without it. So. It doesn't max a 999 can go into quadruple digits. Yes, yes, I do know that. But 999 for the, um... Well, I guess it's only an RPG Nerdos mod that 
you have certain upgrades set to cost 999 scrap, which are supposed to be unattainable, but can be grabbed through other means. So it's more for the memes than it is for the fact that 999 means anything. Hey, thanks for the free stuff. NG sex event. I think the 34 is cheaper than the 50, I think it would cost, so sure. And then I'm not gonna dive. Not, I would only dive for a store. We don't need the store. We don't, there's no store, no reason to dive. All I would care about is getting, you know, heavy flak. Heavy flak number four from Sector 8 store, that is our goal. Oh no, not the door hack. Whatever will I do? Why did I use level two? Wow, okay. Um, that one was a pointless uh, cloak. I shortened it by firing my weapons and didn't even dodge it. The 85%. Are we at the max dodge percent? Did we get to the 95%? We did. I'm pretty sure that was a 95% hit. Great. Uh, I guess maybe this way sees the most number of jumps. We need a crew kill for full rewards here, so how would I crew kill this? Alright, ah, oh, damn it. I was about to do the hacking VOD, and then he just hacks my hacking, so F that. We have to do it phase two of the boss now. I was gonna hack him, and he just hacks my hacking and ruins everything. Ruined everything, sir. Actually, with the BFL, we might be able to do the crew kill. Oh my god, the triple hit. And our zero dodges. Fight him. Go in there, fight him so I can shoot you, bro. No. Oh man, it's so close. Five health. Um. Can I hack hit this some way? Where everything does too much damage, I can't crew kill him. That's screwed. I'm not waiting for a O2 crew kill. Nobody got time for that. No, not you, human NG. Yeah, I breached a, a fire chance. I would have needed a fire. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it was happening either way. Oh well. My impatience. Slow and insidious killer. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, attack escape. The weakness of this ship is showing its face. The fact that it can't get more than level 3 engines. I could be hacking weapons and stuff, but I'm just not. <laughs> Alright, good arrest, Rand. Pass Rand. Watch the profanity. Oh man, we're almost to the 999 just to show we can. We gotta do it just for the lulls. And then I'll start spending the scrap. Gotta throw, show that quadruple digit scrap numbers chat. <laughs> we just get a free eye on blast. <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. Uh, 
Uh, this is another not enough time. Okay, let's see if I can do shield hack. Pull him into the shields. True kill here. Oh, damn it, I could have showed how this works. Okay, chat. Let's see if we can make a YouTube short out of this. So, how do you get a hacking drone past defense drones? This ship right here has two defense drones. My hacking is en route to shields right now. Uh, I didn't show me shooting it, but it's coming in from up here. So what you do is you fire a hacking drone. And if you depower a hacking drone at the right time, the defense drones will shoot at that hacking drone. You depower it, and it misses. So let's see if I can do this right. I turn it on. Here comes a shot. I depower, and... Misses and then you repower it and before the drone can repower You're past it and there you go. That is how you do the uh, defense drone hacking bypass trick There you go Hopefully that works. I will try to remember to get somebody to Hopefully Zach dog can either highlight that or I can remember to do it later Uh I want fires if we can. Oh, he's got a defense drone. The thing I just talked about. Okay, it's fine. I'll do my control. Hopefully that works. I'm gonna take so much damage while trying to do this, aren't I? This guy's got ridiculous pew punage. Burst laser two, burst laser one, burst laser one, combat drone well, beam drone, I guess. Clip this. Stop firing. Okay. Um, we're close here. We're close. Close to the crew kill. Fix that breach, isn't he? He's not through. I think this is just going to do too much hole damage, honestly. Oh, we did it! Ha <laughs> ha! There it is! We broke the 999. There you go, chat. 4K, or four digit scrap numbers. Let's spend some scrap, finally. There we go. And that's still not enough power, actually. Uh, <laughs> backup battery. Level three. Okay. We need 10,000 shields. Sadly, we can only get five, which is actually more than you should be able to get in FTL, but that's what we got. And we spent almost all of it already. Nice. Do, do. All right, we got all the power we can. Level three cloak. I don't have stealth weapons, so I don't think I'm probably going to use cloaking three. Uh, doors. I mean, if this isn't a swag sensors run, I don't know what is. Man, so close to the full upgrade. 95 minus 27 scrap short of the full upgrade. With this ship fight, maybe we can get enough. No way to see the fifth shield. You can kind of see it. You see how this one shield has got like a darker gray coloring? That's because it's gone all the way around to four and then come back around. That's kind of the only way to see it. Oh no, don't hack my backup battery. Pyboy demands the swag sensors. Your wish is my command. This might just one-shot him. Not quite, but some good damage. Video on the next phase. We already did it, Gary. I think we don't need it. 
Uh, is Zack Dog around? Was he able, able to clip that? Um, and actually, I was no power is kind of sucking right now. Level three mind control. Let's see if anybody else is gonna come in here. Probably get one more to kill, maybe. Use level three mind control. Is that good? Maybe. Okay. Uh, all these do too much full damage, so next shot actually just kills him. Okay, so we got one more crew kill. Uh, if I can time it to let him out right as my shots are about to fire. Side room bunk kill, maybe? Potentially. Uh, how close are we? 46 scrap away. I think we might get the full upgrade, chat. Might as well do it phase two, so we'll have two clips to pull from. Sure, sure. Let's we'll see if we can make it happen. Kill your friends. Such a good time to kill your friends. Okay, there it is. The full upgrade with nine scrap to spare. We have completely and utterly destroyed this run, and this ship is as strong as it can possibly be. Nine weapon power, ten shield power, and everything else max. There you go. Pretty rare we get that enough scrap to do that. What's up, Cruel Angel? Ship's name foretold this outcome. What was it called again? It's called the... Oh, I didn't write this one down. I need to put it down on my list to mark it down. All right, so here we go. Second YouTube short, take two. So, how do you get hacking drone past an enemy defense drone? First of all, you hack something. I'm going to hack the shields. Now, watch the, watch the enemy defense drone. As soon as it turns and fires, you depower the drone. The drone does not follow physical laws and stops midair. The shot misses the drone, you repower it, and hacking drone is through. There you go, there is the full video or full uh, demonstration of how to get a defense drone, or a hacking drone past a defense drone. Hopefully that was succinct and clear enough for folks. No misses for you. Um, we have clone bay, but Let's swap them around here. Do another take. We need 93 takes. Okay, I'm a one take wonder. We don't. I don't need all all that. Okay, cloak. I don't have power in my thing there. Uh. Okay. That should be one more crew kill. And GG. Uh, fix the breach. Delta 9. Thank you. Delta 9. Here's the name of this ship. Eagles. I. I can mark it off on the list as completed after this. Just steamrolling of a run. 30 extra bonus scrap that I cannot spend anywhere. Let's go finish him, chat. Finish him. Okay. All right, do I cloak? Yeah, I'm gonna cloak it. 
Let me fucking hit him. Come <laughs> on, man. 95% chance to dodge. 100% chance to be hit. FTL math, chat. FTL math. Those dodge is too good. Did he get a triple hit there? He did get a triple hit to end. <laughs> wow, just end with some F-bombs, why don't you pass Rand? Goodness. All right, the Delta-9. A crazy OP ship from Eagle's Eye, where we had almost the heavy flackening. We had to replace... All right, we couldn't find one heavy flak, so we had to use a ridiculously heavy, awesome, OP, big freaking laser, I guess. So, uh, let's check that score. 62-11. Wow. We hit over 999 scrap, and that's still just a 62.11 run, huh? 2281 scrap in total. Chip looks spooky when it's cloaking. Yeah, the cloak image that with that dark black and the blue lights looks really cool. I like it. All right, my friends. Well, that was three fun runs. Thank you to RPG Nerdos, Mr. Keese, and uh, Eagle's Eye for the ships. Um, nice chill day of overpowered runs. I am always a fan of that. How much free stuff that run? I don't know because the tracker doesn't work for hyperspace for some reason. So I never opened the tracker that used to track that. It doesn't really show. It was a lot. It was a lot of free stuff. So yeah, that probably would have been closer to 7k if we... So much of that wasn't uh, free stuff. <laughs> so my friends, I'm going to call a day there so I can get going and get some stuff done. I need to make that YouTube short and do workout and all that stuff. So as usual, thank you all for watching. I hope you had a good time. Uh, if there's anybody new to the stream, hope you have to follow. Come join us again tomorrow. Harbo, no pause. We have our streak of 17, and we can see if we are 18 or whatever we're at. See if we can keep it alive. We're getting so close to the cycle. God, I can taste it. So as usual, thank you all for the bits, the fo follows, the subs, the giving subs, working, hanging out, all the stuff you all do support the stream. I hope you all have a great night. I will see you all tomorrow or whenever. Peace out, happy gaming, y'all rock. See you later, my friends.